Rochelle, let's take a look at the markets here. You mentioned the fact that we're seeing a bit of a rebound, some of that momentum carrying through for yet another day. The Dow up just around 2%, S&P holding on to gains, the NASDAQ once again the outperformer. Emily McCormick has the latest on that for us. Emily, what's driving today's gains? Well, Shauna, as you mentioned, we are seeing quite a bit of momentum actually picking up here in the markets. The S&P 500 on track for its second straight day of gains. Uh, we do have that index up more than 2% on an intraday basis here. And on a two-day basis, if we count the gains that we saw yesterday as well, up more than 3%. That's being led by the consumer discretionary sector. Only the real estate sector is actually in negative territory this afternoon. Now, I do you want to highlight a couple of uh, areas of a special interest in the markets today, one of those being travel. And now, as we can see, a lot of green across the screen here. And that's after Southwest as well as JetBlue actually raised their sales forecast for the current quarter, really citing strong summer demand here. And as we can see, shares of Southwest are up nearly 7% now. Uh, yeah, nearly 7% on an intraday basis, more than 8% on a two-day basis. And if we look over the course of the year today, Southwest also up by nearly 6%. Although it is a little bit choppy when you take a look at that 2022 picture. Now, one other area of the markets that I want to highlight is retail. Now, of course, uh, we had seen Target and Walmart really uh, sounding the alarm on the economic outlook in results posted last week. Much different picture when we look at the board this week and in today's session especially. We have Dollar Tree especially up nearly 21%. And that's, of course, coming after this company actually raised its earnings forecast for the full year. Really a sharp turn around compared to what we saw from the likes of Target, Walmart, Abercrombie, and Fitch in the past week or so. Uh, so again, much bit better picture when we take a look at this retail board on an intraday basis, guys. Fantastic. We are exhaling. Thank you so much, Emily.